Welcome to my channel. Hey, how are you, friends? All right, so to take this front door out, you gotta take the trim that goes right here. Just pull it straight out. Then there's gonna be another cover here. So you can come down here and unplug two connectors, which are right there. Then you're gonna pull this rubber seal here. You're gonna pull that out. You're gonna have a 12 here, 212 right there on the hinge and 212 on the top. So that's what I'm about to do right now. So let me set you guys over here so you can see what I'm doing. Then we go from there. All right. So, first I'm gonna remove this one right here. start with the bottom one I'm gonna leave the top one last the reason I took this first is because that way you can open swing the door more so it can give you more room over here This one on the side. Bring the new one. All right. So first thing, you gotta bring the wire in. Doing this with one hand, it's kind of hard, so uh, if you can get some help, it would be a lot better. All right, just put the door on your knee to help you balance it. Take these wires in. Take my hand on the inside so I can pull the wire. There. I'll get one of the bowl try to line them up with there. So this time I'm gonna start on the bottom. by hand the most you can to make sure make sure it's in the right way so you don't want to over tread this uh, this door tread inside if you over tread it then you're gonna have a big problem right there I know it's going in smooth so I know I'm good I'm gonna do that one. You gotta put all four before you tighten. I'll do the other one. Bottom top. Alright, so now I know they're in. I'm gonna get my drill. I'm gonna start on the bottom.
to put this one. This one has a little stop. It has a little nipple that goes inside the hole. I'll get my drill. Now it's moment of truth. So when you do this, don't slam the door right away. Go really slow because you don't know if the fender is going to touch or the door is going to be overlapping the other one. So I'm going to go real slow. Real slow. Make sure everything is lining up good here. Then I come over here and I kind of bring it in by hand. So right there, everything look good. I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to slam it now. See, it's not closing. So, all right, so now it's good. So I don't have to slam it real hard. I can just let it go and it work. So I'll show you, I'll show you what I end up doing. I end up putting some uh, some spacer on the hook right there so it can come out a little more that way the door can close real good uh, also if you're having a hard time uh, closing it you can always um, with the door open you put your knee right here, and you can actually bend this out or in. Um, if you have a gap up here, or if it's too tight, you can go either either way. Just make sure the glass is down when you do that. And yeah, that's it. So.